This morning we're on our way to the Vatican City. Thank God we have tickets because the line, what trips up, is like crazy. This is the line, which don't have tickets. It goes all the way around the block. Throngs of people are heading this way. Oh, Papa. It's a summer residence for the Pope in the 15th century. This is the Pinecone Courtyard because of that. Where's this penis? so fast, really impossible to see everything. It's all a bit overwhelming. This is the famous Torso de Belvedere. Crazy, this is so crazy. Too many people. This is all painted on the ceiling, but it looks like it's um, carved. Really cool. Amazing hall. Very crowded. Lots of stuff on the ceiling to look at. Just being herded through this like sheep. I have no idea what I'm looking at. This is the map of Christopher Columbus arriving in the New World. This is the room of the Immaculate Conception. This room is, and we've been here for 10 minutes explaining these paintings, which I can't believe that they crowd so many people into this museum at one time. Okay, we've just been through the Sistine Chapel, which you're not allowed to talk. I think we did it in under three seconds. Yeah, because by the time you get there, you're so over the crowds and the people. And the they said it's really crowded because it's Easter weekend. We're still trying to figure out how to get out of here. Oh my God, to get out of here, you have to walk miles and miles. I just don't see an exit anywhere. It's ridiculous. Oh, my oh, passageway. Skipped a bunch of people. Okay, to finally get out of this museum, you have to go around this long and winding staircase. Which is so weird. <laughs> There's Jeff. Oh my god. <laughs> no, I've lost Jeff. Uh oh. 
So here we are in the square outside the famous St. Peter's Basilica. We've just been through the Vatican Museum. Well, everything inside is overwhelming because there's so much to see and you just can't, you can't simply see it all. And he was getting really irritated because the crowds... Not only me. Yeah, there were I mean, a lot of people getting irritated. It was like sardines. We were like sardines and, and in a can. And some of the tour guides were, were so just rude. so rude. But you can't possibly take it all in. It's just overwhelming. There's way too much. So our day here, I would say, has been fulfilled and we're over so make sure you get here real early when you come in the morning and make sure you get uh, tickets way ahead of time because you're not going to want to stand in these lines and you're not going to want to come during any uh, holiday any holiday because Easter is I the worst Easter or Christmas would be the worst oh my god